Some women are told they should get new mammograms because of questions about the quality of the images from a suburban facility. WGN's Gaynor Hall has the story from Hoffman Estates. If you received a mammogram at Hope Imaging, also known as Hoffman Imaging and Medical Center, on or after October 17th of 2019, state officials say you need to get a second opinion. Mammograms, a critical tool in the fight against breast cancer, but officials at the Illinois Emergency Management Agency, which certifies mammography facilities, is issuing a public notice to patients because of the poor quality of images from Hope Imaging on Higgins Road in Hoffman Estates. In August 2020, the agency issued an emergency order for the facility to cease operations pending accreditation. The American College of Radiology conducted a mammography review of clinical images obtained from October 2019 through July 2020, revealing 16 out of 30 cases did not meet the imaging criteria and the practice posed a quote, serious risk to human health. But despite the order, state officials say the facility under a new name and ownership continued to perform mammograms and about 100 patients were imaged between December 2020 and March of this year. A second emergency order was issued to Hoffman MRI Inc. to cease operations. There's no activity at the office tonight. What we've witnessed is that people do come for their appointments and they knock on the door and there's no one there. Diane Werner works at the travel agency next door. It's a large amount of money to get CT scans, mammograms, x-rays, and if they had paid for that, relied upon that information, and the information isn't trustworthy, that can be very, very sad and devastating. And in another twist to the story in May, 41-year-old Omer Niazzi, who was listed as vice president of Hope Imaging, was charged with aggravated battery after a female patient told police last November she felt burning in her arm after he injected her with contrast solution for a CT scan. But investigators say he was not trained or certified to perform those scans. Again, if you had a mammogram here after October of 2019, you should check with your primary care physician to see if you need to get a new one. We were not able to reach anyone from the facility tonight for comment. Reporting from Hoffman Estates, Gaynor Hall, WGN News.